This tutorial shows you how to make a reading list in D2L using the Libraries of Queso Curriculum Builder tool. First, go to the Content section of your course in D2L. Under Existing Activities, choose External Learning Tools. Then, choose a Queso reading list from the library. Click on the listing to change your title. I'm going to choose Cardiac Catheterization. Then press the Continue Without Copying button to start your list. Now I can search the library resources using a keyword, author, or title. My first will be a book title. After I find my title, I can click on the Teal Add to Reading List button located below the title. Now I'll search by article title. Be cautious to just use the title itself and not a PMID for best results. After that, I will search by keyword. Akeso also allows you the options of searching specific collections, or I can use the limiters on the left to choose by different categories, publications, or collections, including digital images. You can also add notes into a specific resource that you've selected. I can add text or instructions for additional information for each item. I simply click on the text box, add text or instructions, and type. You can sort items and notes by dragging and dropping them within the reading list. Your list will auto-save, and you can now return to the content section. Edit the description field for information about the reading list content. To view the list, click on the reading list title, then see current reading list. A helpful tip may be to copy and paste your see current reading list link. Then, when you go back to your description field, include it in there with the hyperlink itself. That might reduce some confusion of people not knowing that they have to click on the list to see it. You can also add folders or web resources as well as search the library resources if you want to add additional items to your existing list. You can mark your list as public or private. A public list allows you to share this list with fellow faculty members within the D2L community. Private means it's only available in your class section. I hope this tutorial gets you started. For further information and tutorials about ACESO, go to the library's website at library.utsouthwestern.edu.